<sighs> Hi ghosties, this is Meg Ghosty, and yeah, since that video that I promised like a couple of days ago is now today, and I'm so sorry for the, again, a whole of the delay, um, don't know what came over me, I just had a feeling like I want to record this though, it's, people are still going crazy about boycotting and everything, and you know what, I'm not bitching, I'm not gonna complain, I'm actually gonna stick with the people, like I keep saying, <laughs> Anyway, I haven't bought the um, the new recharge suit yet, and I really want to make a video. I'm in the mood for making the video, and I thought, you know, I, I haven't gotten the suit to even make one, but I did promise to talk about the lifetime suit in CN. So, here we are, and, ah, uh, dudes, my friend, I'm gonna call her Erin, she ended up... Um, explaining or bringing up this conversation that people didn't like her because her overall look didn't fit her name. That's right, you heard it. It didn't fit her name. She's not bright enough for her name. She's not even that bright for her name. She's not that bright for her name. Are you fucking kidding me? It's just a name. How many suits do we have that didn't fit the name? A lot. And you complaining about this? Really? Really? Because I have no idea what to complain about. She's not all that bright. Why is she called something bright? She's not fucking... She's not bright at all. <laughs> Dude, she's bright. I mean, come on. Look at this. Look at this. This is literally eye soaring. And I like it. I like it. But my eyes would be like, holy shit, man. Ah. <laughs> But she doesn't have to be extremely bright for your liking because it fits her name. It's ridiculous how people complain about that. Remember, um, I ended up explaining as to why the witch's face, you know, that fairy tale um, event that comes around, goes around. And her face is really, um, is, uh, uh, is smiling and the story isn't really that happy and she's smiling. Remember that one? I think most of you do. I don't know. But I ended up explaining that and I actually got a lot of agreements. And that's just one thing because I think the majority of it should actually be based on the story and not the name of the suit. So if her actual theme doesn't fit her story, then that's where the complaint should go for. And not the fucking name. Okay? Okay. Let's actually um, go right into this. And also, no, there was actually one complaint that people wanted the red version and not the blue version, why the red version didn't have a pose. And to be honest, yeah, why doesn't it have a pose? Because as I believe, if I'm actually corrected, that most of the lifetime suits we had came with poses when it's recolored. Like Warchant, the Northern um, lifetime suit. Like... Yeah, I'm actually thinking, like those twin sisters, they have poses, including in the recolor one. Then I don't know what else we had. I, I am actually bad at keep. Oh, 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 I think the, I don't know, because I don't have her, I don't pay much attention to her. The white version of White Blossom, I don't know about that one. I honestly don't have any clue. But we've got three lifetime suits that came with poses. And this one doesn't. But it's not really new, if I'm honest with you. It's not new to know about that. Some lifetime suits come with recolored poses. Some doesn't. So I'm not going to complain about that. But go off wherever's just... I don't give two shits. Okay, let's go right into the pose, the pose, the pose, the pose, the pose, the pose. Okay, she is covered in so much blue. Like, literally, aesthetically pleasing. So I'm not going to complain. She has a lot of majority of brightness around her, like her ornaments, and she is in fact blue and white, and therefore she, if you, if your eyes go really blurry, and then you, you look at her, like my eyes right now, you can see how bright she is, so yes, <laughs> she's bright. <laughs> Um, okay, uh, okay, okay. I think she has like gloves, but I'm not too sure, let's get a little bit closer. I think she does have like robotic gloves or even more just like a tattoo, but I'm not too sure about that. And then she has all this beautiful electronic devices all over her dress. And then she has like a star theme that we see in like Diana's dream. Um, 
I don't like the hair. In the original pose, her hair is flowing, and I don't like that. I want it to relax. Um, I like that she has, like, a blue sort of quantum all around it. I'm not too sure what you call those blue lines, but I don't know. Um, I think she comes with wings, because if you look at the back of her, there's, like, some form of electronic device there as well, but I'm not too sure. I have no clue. Um, then we have her crown, which... It, can we go closer to the crown? No, we can't. There we go. I know it's pixely, but I'm sorry. So we have her crown here, which is... I, why do I keep calling it a crown? Sorry, it's Halo. And it's got a star theme. It's beautiful. I think it's going to be a movable item, if I'm corrected. Because it's hovering above her and looks really massive. So I think it could be a movable. I'm not too sure. Um, let's go back to the close-up because I want to talk about her makeup. Her makeup is not really that nice. Um... It's very basic, it's very leaned forward, so it's not that like, oh my god, her eyes are amazing. Yes, I mean, they got like a nice glassy blue sort of like marble look to them, but it's just too like common. The expression that we have right here is just like too common. And then we have like light blue lipstick, which is it's becoming a little bit common. Um... The overall shape of the eye, though, it's oval and it's not, like, really straight lines. So I actually like the shape of the eye. Then we have at least a grey eyebrow, which is, like, what? Wait, it's not brown and it's not black, but it's grey. Holy shit. That's actually cool. And then I think, I think if you look closely, we have a tattoo or something across her eye. So I'm not too sure if it's a tattoo or is it going to be attached to the makeup. I'm not, I'm not so... Um, solid with that i don't think she has a choker or a necklace because the dress is literally <laughs> going up her neck and we see her earrings so she's gonna have earrings um i don't know what's on her legs can we see through her le dress i don't think she has legs so i'm not too sure if she's gonna have well she should have shoes so i'm not too sure but look at this nice holographic blues and purples and pinks coming together and then forming up into this white and blue sort of look. Absolutely gorgeous. She's absolutely amazing. And hair like that, hair like that, like, come on. Mm. But like I said, I don't like how it's flowing. I want it to actually relax a bit. And as she, you can see there's like some form of electronics around her wrists. And it goes down to this, which I don't know what the hell that is, but it looks monstrous. And then we, I think we have another one here, but I'm not too sure if it's attached to the hair. Do you see that shading in the boob area? Holy shit. I didn't notice that there before, unless it's just on his suit. And it's very tight fitting around Nikki, and it makes me very uncomfortable looking. I don't like tight fitting dresses, just like this one. I just more likely like loose and everything like that, but it's just it's just me and my ways of looking into things. But yeah, I think she's absolutely nice. There's a lot of color scheme, and I guarantee that most of her items would be very useful with um, the deep sea one and NR. Something with blue and white in Ruin Islands, which is majority of them. Then we have a hologram over here, then we have a star at the bottom of it with some hairs of her, which is, oh my god, the hair, man, is absolutely everywhere. I can't wait to actually see someone complete her, make a video about completing her, so it would be very nice. And then we have a little um, tail of the dress, just, it looks like a mermaid's tail, if I'm going to be honest with you. Like a mermaid, the kind of design mermaid's tail, is really cool. Um... But yeah, I actually like how she looks, and I can't wait to get her someday in Love Nikki. If Love Nikki pulls the strings together and try and make this survive, then we have the red version. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. She's so fucking hot, I have to say. The blue version makes her look innocent, but this version makes her look, oh my god, you spicy. So yeah, I actually like how she really fucking looks. Like, Everything white and then black and red. Oh my god, girl, you could kidnap me any any day. Um, I don't think she has ornaments. I don't know because I'm not really seeing those exact ornaments 
from the blue suit to this one, so I'm, I'm a bit concerned for that. A little tad bit concerned. The halo is nice, it's like blood red. Actually, all of it is like blood red. And to be honest, I get them both, honest to gosh. So, <laughs> Oof, I don't know what else to tell you, man. I'm so freaking hyped for this. I actually like the Cleopatra one as well. I don't think I actually reviewed her, but I might as well look into my um, videos and see if I did or did not. So, hopefully um, I get to make the review on her if I didn't. <clears throat> But I actually like how they go through all nations and give them a lifetime suit. Like Apple with White Blossom, Lilith with the Mario, the Grice twins, or Twi Grice itself, I don't know. And then we have Cloud with Stunning Beauty, Pigeon with the Twinnies, um, Northern Kingdom with Warchant, Wasteland with Cleopatra sort of theme, and then Ruin with these bitches. So... We only have, like, majority of them, but we need, like, um, Cleopatra and the Ruin suit. <laughs> Sorry, I'm out of breath. I am know I'm unfit, but... Uh, but what do you guys think of this suit? Do you really think she's going to be worth your time? Do you think you're going to complete her, or you, you just want to leave her because she's not bright enough? <laughs> what do you guys expect? Um, what do you guys really like about her? Anyway, have a nice life.